absolutely no soil. Very cool. Okay, are we going to talk water lilies? All right, already very, very popular. Um, I hope I didn't make a mistake by not ordering these before the show because I know a lot of you guys have already picked yours up. We used to sell these. Yeah, I remember when I was a younger, newer host uh, starting out doing gardening here years and years ago. These were one of the most popular Roberta's items. And then they weren't able to get them for us for a long time. But they are back from the vault this year. This is a pre-grown water lily live plant. It comes in a kit which looks just like this. You're going to get this little. It's also a great people always buy these for Mother's Day and stuff because they come in this great little kit like this. So um, I'm going to put them all out here because we have four different colors for you to choose yes. from. Um, so this will grow in a pond or a bucket or an urn. You don't have to have a lake or a pond or anything on your property. Any little container of water, these will be very happy in. And if you get a larger bucket or a whiskey barrel, you can do what we've done here and put multiples in a large container of water. So the choices are red, which is this one. I'll show you the kits right here, guys. Red or pink or yellow and I don't have the white one out here. Do we have any white left, Frank? I, I have the okay, white. Okay, so here, white Carolyn. is the other the other choice. Okay. Yeah, you can, Go ahead, Court. I was just gonna say show the overhead shot of that white. It's so pretty. Mm -hmm. The white and the yellow. This one. Uh, and, and then the uh, red and the pink together. So you can put more than one in the same little tub there or in the ground. But really I know you have a goose pond. We've heard you talk about it so oh, many yeah. times. But you don't need to have a muddy uh, bottom pond to grow these. This is the kind of plant that you see, these cold winter hardy water lilies at places like the Biltmore Longwood yes. Garden. Uh -huh. And you can have the same look and enjoy those beautiful flowers in your own backyard without a pond, without acreage, just in a tub of water like you're looking at right there. They bloom June through uh, the first frost and they they're perennial Carolyn they come back yeah, they come back a single year all right and Court, it's been about 15 years since we've had these here and but we finally got them back okay I want to show everybody what they have to do because it's really easy so yes. they come in this kit yes tell me what I do and they're attached to this little floating flower yes. because before they start blooming this will re see the string it's attached to this will remind you what color this is going to turn into so right it shows you where you put it in your container so let me yeah. show you here because i actually have a tub of water set up okay. just to show you all right so it's going to come in the kit like you said with the uh color of water lily on the top growing guide printed on the uh the container you're going to just remove the uh this part you know remove the label and then you're going to submerge this it can be 12 inches down to 24 okay. inches you're going to submerge it in your uh in your container i'm using philip watson's whiskey barrel here it can be anything 12 to 16 inches deep okay you're done that's it what? of course i don't have to do anything else no you know if you have it in a container, you're going to want to make sure that it's continually uh, filled with water. Yeah, you don't want the water to the, evaporate. Let's right. go through the images. I want to show you okay. how beautiful they are and what you can expect. These are going to attract the uh, the butterflies and dragonflies. Yeah, and dragonflies uh, love water lilies. So, yes. uh, and you know, if you have a, a little pond, it'll soon be looking like a Monet painting if you've got several of these. Yes. Because, Court, Monet don't they paint. make more flowers once they get going? Oh, yes. Look at look. that. that you know, years ago, that was probably just started with one plant, but look how it multiplies. Mm -hmm. And you're looking at both of them. One is in a whiskey barrel and one is in a real pond. So you can grow them any way you want. And this is red. I love these at these uh, you know, four easy payments uh, or five easy payments, you might as well pick up one of each color. There's the beautiful yellow. So many of us are now doing water features. That's why we had to bring them back. Mm -hmm. We searched the world to find a complete kit that would guarantee your success. Look at the beautiful yellow. Yeah. And folks, we all have these kind of plastic terracotta looking pots on hand. Uh -huh. You know, make sure it doesn't have a drainage hole and uh, fill it with water and then plant your water lilies. Look at the beautiful leaves. They're gorgeous. Floating, they just float on yeah. top of the water 
and then the flowers emerge. They come back every single year. They're cold hardy. So this whether, is a kind of plant. I was just going to say whether see. whether you have a small little water feature that you uh, built, maybe with for a little with a little goldfish or two swimming around in it, or yes. you've got a large pond, but you don't have to have any of that. If you just have a container that doesn't have a leak or a uh, drainage hole at the bottom, uh, or if right. it does, be sure and plug it up uh, so that the water stays in the bucket, and then you can grow these right in a bucket or a, a little urn or anything. I'm telling you, you can grow it in uh, a five-gallon bucket of water mm -hmm. if you want it to, and a lot of people do. Why not? It's easy. It's beautiful. So uh, 800 orders have been placed. Okay. Uh, Court, white is the most limited. We only have a yeah. few hundred left, but very popular in the yellow and red today. Okay. Uh, I, I would get all four. Look at the stamens, the bright yellow stamens in there. That's the male part of the plant. Now watch it. This is what yeah. you'll see. Look it's, at that time lapse. It's it, absolutely gorgeous. Wow. And you know, these flowers are stunning. I mean, the color is stunning. I love the shape of all the petals. They're large blooms. They float right on top of the water and they're uh, amongst all that beautiful green foliage. The leaves that they grow are gorgeous as well. And uh, if you have a pond with fish in it, uh, go ahead and put these right the on fish. top of the water. Yeah. Yeah, well, it actually is great for the fish. It keeps them, it keeps them uh, happy and nutri nutrients for the fish. Excellent. So stay in the ordering process. These are five payments of $5.40. A thousand have been ordered. Uh, these are back from the vault, everybody. So be sure and get yours before they're gone. Those are very popular.